What's up, YouTube? Here we go. Alright, today we're going to do the RTA Mods 359. Yes, I know. It's a paid mod. It's a paid DLC. But, look how pretty it is. There's actually quite a bit you can do with it to customize it. Um, I'm going to just jump in here. You can, apparently this is new that you can put a sleeper on it, but I kind of like the day cab. Let's leave that as is. <coughs> Excuse me. We'll put a whole bunch of power in it. Um, I tested this truck a couple of days ago and what really turns out to be better is the uh, 10 speed here. You get more top speed on it. It's because the differential is set so low. If I go with this 18 speed, differential is 410. You don't get no further than like 65 miles an hour. With the 355, you can run 75 and 80. Um, interior. Uh, there's red, there's this pink color, black, and it typically comes with white. Um, as far as I can understand, depending on what color interior you get, your gauge lights are different. If you get the black, you get, I think, a teal gauge light. And the rest of them are different, but I kind of like the black interior, so we're going to go with that for right now. Um, paint job. Um, all these clunk. These are uh, DLC mods on Steam. He's actually got quite a bit of them. And you can change the color of them. Except that one. And that one. And that one. And that one. These, you can click over here and change the color, but it doesn't actually do anything. And then there's all these metallic colors. And then this one. Right now, um, let's see which one was it that I liked. There it is. Let me change this. This is just kind of see that. That green right there, it just brings out that sparkle. Change that to a teal color, that looks a little better. And we'll leave that black alone. Just in case everything decides to crash. Alright, as far as interior accessories there's really not much in here although right now I have uh, Cecil's mega packs but they don't work on this truck I'm 
we'll go down here to where was it? There it is. Black one. I really like the white. That's slightly off white. That's a little that's a little bright for me. There's black and there's tan. We'll go with that. But um, as you can see, uh, Cecil's mega add-on pack doesn't work here because I can't put C-3PO in the passenger seat. So, but I still have C-3PO set to uh, be my co-pilot. He still has my... Uh, My GPS navigator. There we go. See which one was tanks? I like the step on the side. The frame, the frame is really cool paint the frame the same color as the truck or you can have it bright red which doesn't necessarily look right with this color combination and black is just a little drab I don't know about you but on these older trucks when the when you see them out on the roads and stuff or at uh, truck shows where they've been customized and uh, restored basically I think it looks so much better if the frame is painted to match the rest of the truck. <clears throat> like a sun visor. Something we can see the road with. Alright, the hood plate here. There we go. That's the one I wanted with these little side stripes on the hood. I'll go to aluminum, takes it off. That one's got it, and that one don't. I paint it, but I kind of like the chrome. Uh, let's see what else we got here. The headlights, there's a bunch of different headlight options. Uh, headlights chrome see it took that little visor off of it a little over over the top visor like that and that just paints the back side of the light the same color we'll go back up to chrome see there's chrome now you can see it better it took that cover off of it um, there's other options Got those. And that's it. This those three different types. And that's a bit much. I don't much care for those. So I'm going to go back up with these with the little visor on. That's really cool. Front grille. A whole bunch of different options. Kind of like that. I'll probably come back to that one. put the logo in it yeah like that looks best and up here I'm zoomed in as far as I can go Uh, put the V8 logo on it. That's what that did. Let's go back over here. 
same logo, just logo gold has a gold tint to it. I like just a handle. We'll just keep it at that. Uh, roof lights. That just changed the ring around the actual light bulb itself. And then that changed the whole thing black. So that's the whole thing black. That's chrome with just a black ring around the lights. And then there's all chrome. You can just barely see it. If you watch it as a tick back and forth between the two. You can see the difference there. Um, horns. Got open trumpets. Closed trumpets. Short trumpets. I kind of like the big ones. Let's go with that. Uh, let's see. Mirrors. That's without the little spot mirror. Blacked out. If you want to go for that totally blacked out look. That's the spot mirror on top in black. Same in chrome. And then double spot mirror. It's a bit excessive. We'll just go with that one. Okay. One thing here. Uh, trailer coupling. I'm not entirely sure what this changes. But when I was testing it the other day, um, I couldn't hook up to the trailer. <coughs> so what I had to do was uh, take a load of one of those uh, extreme heavy haulers. The, the real big loads that you get the police escort. I had to take one of those loads um, that automatically hooks the trailer up to your truck by itself. And when I did that, I had... The RTA coupling turned on. I didn't have SCS. I, I tried both ways to hook up to a trailer and neither one would work for some reason. So I had to get the escort load. See if that would do anything. Um, let's see what else we got. got steps. Step 2 in black. Oh, I, that says black. And that puts the actual steps in black. Eh, kind of like the old school look. Okay, what do we got? Air filters. Chrome them out. Paint them, which I think looks better. And then these little things. This little thing. Oh, you can do each one separately. Cool. Huh. You can change this one. interesting huh okay I like that a little bit more symmetrical I think it looks better wings basically a fancy word for fenders colored double over fenders Painted. I don't know. We'll go with the painted this time. We'll see. Oh, that gave us the uh, little lights on the sides there. That's the tube. What is that? That's wings.
There was one here. No, oh, that ain't it. Okay. This is what we wanted. Well, that ain't right. It's this one up here. Rolling coal. Now, what's interesting about that is uh, when I tested it the other day, that smoke doesn't turn off when you turn the engine off. So that smoke just stays on the whole time. So even if you're sitting there looking at the truck on the outside and you shut the engine off, it's still going to be blowing smoke. So uh, you can see that green really shining through at this angle. <clears throat> and that's pretty much it. And uh, I don't know if you've been watching these videos, I had a truck that had a Stars and Stripes paint job. Well, I sold that truck so that I could buy this one. What happened? Don't tell me I just lost all that. Ah. Oh. All right, well, that just throws that one out the window. But anyway, at least you get to see all the different customization. Uh, I'm going to go back and see what happened here. There you go. Okay, so I think I figured out what the problem was. Um, it's It's got something to do with this mod and buying the truck this way. Uh, what you got to do is you just got to go here and just hit purchase. And then pick your, pick your place in your garage that you want to put it and just go ahead and buy the truck. Just as is, don't customize configuration or anything. Just buy the truck. Then exit out of here, exit out of here, and then find a shop and just drive over there and then customize it because that's pretty much the only way you're going to be able to buy this truck. You got to just purchase it and then drive it to a shop and customize it. I, I saw another video of somebody else. Uh, reviewing this truck and they didn't explain why that happened but it seems uh, no one requires my services at the moment so I shall assist you if I may but uh, that's essentially what they did is they bought the truck got to their garage here and then, uh, keep right drove master it over to the and then shop turn right master build it the way they want it Perfect. Here we go. Turn right, Master. And this is what the inside looks like.
right past them. I just and did. Can be exit back. I'll try to breeze through it. Can be exit back. So we can see a little bit more of this pretty truck. There we go. You have arrived. <laughs> and my stars. It is you. It is you. Desolate. This is. See it in the rain. There's your wipers. Like I said, the, the 355 give you higher top speed, and the 18 speed only comes in at 410, which, like I said, tops you out at about 65 miles an hour. So the 355, you can run 75 and 80. Let's see, which one was it? There it is. This one, a little bit more color. We want the lights, uh, the big smokestacks. We want it. Roll coal out of them smokestacks. If I can get on it here. There it is. Roof lights. Horn. Chrome plate with the little side accents. There we go. We 
wanted the double fenders painted so you can paint the tank <clears throat> with no step kind of like it with no step already got the turn lights we wanted the body colored frame steps are fine mirrors are fine actually I'm I'm loving the wheels that's on it already so I'm not gonna change it I mean you can you got plethora oh and they actually set it up to where you can unlock stuff cool so it's not like some other trucks that are just uh, everything's unlocked from the get-go uh, Did the interior black? Yeah. Teal. All right, so with black interior, that's what color lights you get. If you're wondering what the crying baby in the background is, just had a baby Friday the 13th. Okay, the pink changes to purple dash lights. the dash lights too. Red. Off. On. Off. Off. Alright, let's see what White lights. There's white dash lights. Now we're gonna pull forward, stop, back up. So I kind of like the black interior with the teal lights. So we're gonna switch back to that. I think the dash lights match the rest of the truck if they're if it's all the same color there we go and there you 
you have it. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video. Sorry about the watermark. I haven't paid for the video editing software quite yet. So, uh, maybe in the future, I'll pay for the editing software. So I can just put several videos together in one and not have a big, ugly, unsightly watermark. Anyway, there you go. RTA Mods 359. Thank you and have a good day.